live in Birmingham, Alabama, Classic Suzuki. We're here with Chris Justice, General Sales Manager. I just spent an additional week here after a recruiting campaign. We like to call it AutoMax the full course. Chris, break it on down for me. How'd hey, that go? Hey, listen, it was insane. We had um, had a great time. As you know, I'm a fan of Automax. When I originally got here, one of the biggest needs in Birmingham was talent. You cannot make this thing go without talent. You gotta have the right people. And I had a challenge finding good salespeople. You know, Suzuki was a, known to be a smaller store in the area, kind of laid back, and I came to make something happen and make something big happen. And I couldn't get um, couldn't get people to buy in. So I brought in the J Mac. Mm -hmm. J Mac brought in the recruiting. He brought in the NFL draft. He put <laughs> people upstairs. He trained them. I didn't believe that we could get the caliber of salespeople that he told me we could get. I doubted him. I betted against him, and I lost. He came through, and that month we doubled our sales. Next month, we doubled our sales again, and by the fourth month, number one in the southeast, number one in the state. Number one, baby! Number one, soon to be number one in the country. That's an exciting story. And this, do you see the value in that extra week after the recruiting campaign? Absolutely. Tell us the value. Absolutely. After four months, we hit a plateau. We hit a plateau. I needed some new salespeople, but I needed some. I needed an injection into my sales force. I needed a new process, something to kind of get us over the edge, something to get these salespeople started off quickly to ensure that they had the highest probability of success. J Mac, we talked about it. I'm a little upset that we didn't talk about it earlier. However, it is a new expense, so I felt. It turns out that it's an investment because it's an investment that paid off big. These salespeople came out of the class and immediately they started working deals. Never happens. Typically we take the new recruits and we put them in a room and they start learning product knowledge and they start looking through books and sales material and they kind of get a little discouraged. And that's our fault. J Max said there's a better way. Let me get them started quickly. And here's something you never see. Yes. Never see. A green pea, never sold cars before, sells three cars their first week. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And every other recruit, every other person out of that class sold a car. And that taste of success is going to lead to retention. And uh, the sooner they get in there, get their uh, hands dirty, I mean, the better off it's going to be all the way around for the dealership as a whole. And uh, I'm just glad to be excited about a 500% increase since day one. And you're not done yet. We're not done yet. We got a lot more work to do. But I, I can just say this. Let me just go back to a point that the sooner you get the salesperson in front of a customer yes. and build their confidence and get that first car deal under their belt, the more likely they are to be successful, stay happy, be productive, and not blow out on you, not quit on you. Exactly. I mean, when they come out of that class, they're so charged and ready, it's like coming out of the ether. And we don't want them to come out of the ether. You don't send your customer home when they've made up their mind on the right vehicle, the right price, and the right time. No, you know what? Go home and think about it and come back on Monday. You don't do that. You get these people jacked up, pumped up, and you get a couple deals under the belt, put some money in their pocket, right. and that's how we do things. That's right. how we get down. Right. That's how JMAC gets down. That's how Automax gets down. Right. All right, absolutely. It's like a one-two punch. The training module, they get trained, they get excited, they get motivated, they get sold on the business. Now when they come out of the class, it's like, okay, now what do I do? Yes. Automax is gone. No, Automax needs to be there one more week to make sure that they're going to be successful, to make sure they get off to a good start, and they will sell cars the first week. I've never seen anything like it. Absolutely. I appreciate everything. Uh, you've been a gracious host, and I'm proud to be a part of your success. And... Uh, my hat's off to you for future success, and uh, thank you very much again for the week. One more thing. Yes. Never bet against J-Mac, never bet against Automax. Absolutely. Thanks, Chris. Thank you.